From the strange and unexplained to the things that go bump in the night, this program has been created to help you survive against the very real threats in this world. These are the Creature Files. <coughs> Creature File number 15, Goblins. Goblins are an interesting creature that live all across Europe and Scandinavia. They are actually closely related to fairies, but if fairies stand for peace and harmony, well, then goblins are the exact opposite. Though this hasn't always been the case. Goblins are a small humanoid creature and are usually around the size of a small child. They resemble fairies and elves, their other cousins with their pointed ears and magical abilities. They can come in a variety of colors and shapes, with some having a green complexion and some having fur that covers most of their bodies. Goblins used to be harmless house elves that would steal food in the night in exchange for doing simple household chores. They would sew holes in socks, shuck corn, and help in any way that they could. Oftentimes, the only issue was that goblins are tricksters. And usually these pranks were simple, things like hiding important things from a homeowner, but many goblins began to take their jokes and pranks too far, causing people to cast them out of their homes. Removing a goblin isn't as simple as just kicking them out of your house either, as they'll usually return a day later to continue their tricks. While goblins can be forced out through divine powers, the simplest way is actually just to offer a goblin a piece of clothing. Whether it's due to their pride or they take it as an insult, a goblin will abandon a home shortly afterwards. After years of evicting trouble-causing goblins, goblins began to gather together deep in forests or in caves, breaking away from old traditions while harboring a resentment to the humans who cast them out. Goblins switched their focus from human food to our currency, and they began to hoard mass amounts of gold and other objects of value. While there have been instances of goblins taking children hostage for a ransom to be paid in gold, they don't actually pose much of a threat to humanity and can be easily bought off. It's recommended that communities near goblin settlements establish a fund to funnel money to these creatures in secret. This concludes Creature File number 15, Goblins. Tune in throughout the week and the rest of this month for more survival tips and creature portfolios. And as always, stay safe out there.